Alrighty, I obviously have a construction update for you today. You're going to get some really awesome angles of Tundra Twister, and you're going to see it like you haven't seen it yet. I promise you, these are really awesome shots, okay? I know Ken is one of them posted their video, and that's awesome too, but they didn't show it completed for some reason. Or was I just blind? Did I just miss that? But I don't think they showed it completed. So you're going to see it completed um, in today's video without the gondolas, but otherwise it looks it's so big. Like, it's so big. Um, but nonetheless, people are going to make jokes in the comments section now. What did I just set myself up for? Um, anyways, what you're seeing on the screen right now, Clockworks is done. Okay, they're doing location training. Um, this is what they call, like, serting someone in a position. So you'll see, like, a supervisor or an area supervisor or a trainer walking around with someone in position. You see them buddied up. And they're training them how to do the actual, you know, ride cycling, checking the restraints. And then if they do good, they get serted. And once they're serted, that means they're good to operate the ride. So right now, they're just serting um, people in their position at Clockworks. I caught it on camera. I thought it'd be really cool to show you guys how it's kind of done and how training goes. Um, and then you're going to see Clockworks operate. I thought I'd include that. Uh, but you know what? I just thought about it. <clears throat> I'm just going to throw Clockworks moving, actually moving, to the end of the video. So I'm going to cut it here. We're going to go into the construction update um, right about now. Boom. Um, okay. So the paint job on Vortex is coming along really nicely. Look how vibrant that red is. It looks so good. I know it's the same colors and we were kind of expecting maybe something a little better, but it truly looks so good. Um now knowing that Behemoth is coming up too, I'm excited. I'm really excited. Wonderland's got a lot of, you know, you if you were paying attention to the podcast yesterday, it's got a lot of money coming its way. But whoa, Tundra Twister. Tundra Twister. Wait, what am I doing? Back to Tundra Twister. Oh, wait, no, wait. There's Snoopy's Racing Railway. And for some reason, hardly anything has occurred over there. The station's looking really good, but still, I'm kind of shocked that uh, it looks like... Not much going on, but I guess the team that does Snoopy's is also doing Tundra, so they're rushing to complete this, because I can tell you right now, they got the um, the raising and lowering platform on site now, too. It's it's parked over there, the, the main kind of infrastructure, um, the outer edges, which you'll see in this video. I'm going to cut to music shortly, because there isn't really much to say. You're just going to get all these really awesome angles and shots of Tundra Twister. You're going to get to see it contrast to Yukon Striker's height. Um, this thing is massive. The drone footage makes it look so much smaller than it actually is. I promise you that. Okay. Cut to music right about now. Thanks for supporting the channel. Um, and thank you to my Patreons, especially there's a lot of you now, like there's truly a lot of you. So thank you for supporting the channel and joining me on my journey. Have a good one guys. Bye. Small city thinking, I get why you left. Small minded people.